in charge of my destiny. Oh my princess, you are welcome to our kingdom. As a matter of fact, I, my family, and the entire kingdom have been waiting for this magnificent feat of yours to grace this palace. Please, have a wonderful stay in our palace. Please, welcome. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. Thank you so much. My princess. Oh, my princess. In fact, rumors didn't do justice to your elegance. Your ravaging beauty is unprecedented. Wow. You're very much welcome to our palace. We cannot wait to treat you to a scrumptious meal. Thank you You're so welcome. much, my queen. Thank You're you welcome. so much. I appreciate Your Majesty, I can't see Lutana. Did he travel? Oh, yes. He has been preparing for this particular day. As a matter of fact, that was why he slept so late. I believe he's dressing up now. He will join us soonest at the dining. <laughs> That's so kind of him. Uh, princess, on behalf of uh, Igwe's cabinet members, I welcome you to this great kingdom. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, my princess, how about my friend, your father, Sadat Amba. He's doing very well, Your Majesty. He sent his regards. I know. He's a good friend. You're welcome there. You're welcome. <laughs> Who is that? Who is that? It's me. Come see. Mama, welcome. Come see. What is going on? Why are you crying? Mama, no, nothing. I, I am fine. You are not fine. You know you can tell that to a stranger, not me. So talk to me. What is it? Mama, Noma told me that the palace is welcoming Princess Zikora in a grand style. So? She said that the elders are wearing their royal attire. <laughs> Mama, he made it something special, something symbolic. So? Mama, stop. Can't you read the writing on the wall? Remember, our king has always wanted to be the king of kings of the state. So if they are welcoming Princess Ikura and Krasta, it means that there's more to, to this than meets the eyes. Just have faith. What will be, will be. Stop crying, nothing works this year. I am scared. I am, I am very scared, Mama. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. You see, today is a special day. Crafted by Chukwo Kikabiyama himself. For my lovely brother, Prince Lutanna. And his beautiful dancer, Princess Zikora. I want us to toast to this wonderful union. For everlasting love between my brother, Prince Lutanna, and Princess Zikora. And let the earth be a witness to this. Let us lift our glasses up. Uh, um, please, um, I'm pressed. Please. 
and I can't can't hold it any longer than this. I I I, I need to go. Please let me ease myself. You, you can go after this. No no no. Let, let me ease myself. I'll be back. I I'm not done yet. One second. Um, you see, don't worry. Um, it's like he ate something that contains a lot of pepper. Okay, he will come back. Come on, go ahead and eat your food. He will continue when he comes back. Hmm? Good. Oh no. With what happened in the palace today, I'm not beginning to understand your worry. Mbanefo, the grey hair on my head are not artificial. Neither did they spring up out of hunger. Mba. You can imagine Prince Lotana telling his father, the king of this great kingdom, that he cannot come out to welcome Princess Zikora. I mean, disobeying the king's direct order means war and insubordination. <laughs> I bet you, if the king does not control his temper, he might lead him into taking a right decision which will not speak good of this kingdom. We will keep doing our best as elders of this kingdom. We'll try. Oh no. Before he became the king of this kingdom, mm. you both have been very good friends. That's true. Please, That's true. I beg of you, talk to him about his temperament. <laughs> we all know that our king gets angry easily. And Prince Lutana, his first son, inherited that from him. Mm. Mm. If the boat continues this way, <laughs> Uh, something strange, something bad might happen and which will not speak good of the kingdom. Send for me, Father. Lieutenant, now what have you done? I am confused. How will you go against my command? Have you lost your mind? Your Majesty, I am still confused. What are you talking You do not play the game of pretense with me, boy. First, you refuse to come out to welcome your guest. Oh, your guest, Father. Your guest. Not mine. Cut me one more time and I will show you what kings do to their insubordinate subjects. Princess Zikora left here in a basket, courtesy of your stupidity and carelessness. Just pray, her heart still beats for you. Else, your action will be too late to regret. Dad, I have told you this before and I'm going to say it again for the optimth time. You are not going to impose on me a woman that I don't want. I have a relationship with Kamsi. Kamsi is the woman for me. Now listen to me. Today should be the last day you will be mentioned the name of a nobody that has nothing to offer as a bride. That has nothing to offer? Dad. Kamsi? suddenly has nothing to offer. Have you forgotten in a hurry how she came to my aid when I needed help? Where was your Zikora when I needed help? Have you suddenly forgotten, Father? Your Majesty, as you already know, uh, the full moon of Ogugu appears in two weeks. Peke Ogugu, to be precise. And we, the elders in council, have come to know if your choice of heir apparent is still Prince Lutana or 
you have changed. <laughs> oh no. And um, elders of Anyogu, once again you're welcome. You see, before the eagle lands to pick its prey, there has been a careful calculation in order to be precise so as not to miss. Your Majesty, you are very correct. <laughs> um, as you all know, I have two sons in whom I am well pleased. <laughs> yes, in as much as um, Lotena is as stubborn as me, does not change the fact that he's my son. And I still love him. Coming back to your question on the issue of um, heir apparent to the throne of my ancestors, you will get the answer. And on that note, I'll tell you that my heir apparent to the throne is... Uh, Doka, what's the problem? Why are you knocking like that? I want to see His Royal Majesty. Do you have any appointment with His Majesty? It's very urgent and I need to see His Majesty right now. I'm sorry you cannot go in. His Majesty is having a meeting with his cabinet members. And you know what happens when anyone's entered there. Except from the royal family and the royal servants. Please, tell His Royal Majesty that his son, Prince Lutana, had an accident and he was rushed to the general hospital. Your Majesty, your wisdom is without comparison. <laughs> you see, we need someone who is strong enough to make a decision that will favor our people and stand by it. That's the kind of person we need. Yes. And uh, Prince Lutana will do that for us. <laughs> ah. Greetings, my king. What is it? Greetings, my elders. Udoka, son of late Iche Umima, just reported that Prince Lutana had an accident. What? What? And was rushed to the family hospital. My king. What? Where is my phone? Ah, 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 ah. This is not pleasant at all. Hello? Dr. Franklin? Come see. Since I had this accident, you have been with me, by my side. I want you to go home, come see. I want you to go back to your mother. I also want you, I know it's going to be hard, but I need you to begin to get me out of your mind and out of your heart. Come see, since I came back home, the opticians have been doing their best to find a cornea donor. And the ones they have found so far are either too healthy or from a dead person. My father does not want to hear of that. He is looking for a living donor, which is almost a mission impossible. I don't know how long this will take. Come see. I want you to live your life. I don't want you to marry a blind man. You're a good girl. You have your whole life ahead of you. And you deserve the best. I wish you a nice life. Please. Take care of yourself. And take care of your mother. Why would this happen to the love of my life? 
just wait. My king, I am so grateful to Oboko for the success of this surgery. You know, at first I was so scared when the doctor said it was a chance of 50-50. <laughs> but I told you that Oboko can never forget her own. Hmm. I told you. <laughs> but one thing I know for sure is that Oboko can never allow a blind man to rule this kingdom of ours. <laughs> You're right. I am glad and at the same time bothered. Bothered? Yes. What bothers you on this joyous day? My king, have you forgotten what happened? Have you forgotten how the cornea came about? I believe he will understand. Yes. It wasn't our fault. You and I know our son and how he is. You know how he behaves. <laughs> Are you sure he's going to forgive us? But you equally know that it wasn't our decision. It was a critical moment and our hands were tied. <sighs> well, I think uh, if everything is explained to him, he will understand. Please, for now. Let's forget about that and celebrate the gods <laughs> for restoring our son's sight. Of course, it calls for celebration. Igwe. <laughs> I never made a mistake choosing you. You are the love of my life. You started. You started. <laughs> Why are you like this? Why are you holding a stick? What happened to your sight? Huh? My, my parents' eyes are vision now. My vision is, is alright now. Why can't you see me? What is going on? She's the anonymous uh, Konya donor. We tried talking her out of it, but she insisted. And no one told me about it. Son, she made us swear never to let you know until the surgery is over and you're good. Why? 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 But my parents, I couldn't watch you wallow in pain. I couldn't stand you give up without a fight. I... I did what I did for love. Listen, if if your sight is intact, I know I will see through you. You didn't have to do this. You did have to do this. You had no business losing your sight. Come see this was not the plan. Don't do this. Because this was not the plan. Why? Don't do this. Why did no one tell me about it? Everything that I can to ensure that you regain your sight. Do you understand? Do you can you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Very well. <sighs> it's alright, baby. I got you. Okay. I got you. No one forced her to do what she did. That was her choice. Besides, I would have gotten a donor if she didn't volunteer. 
But she volunteered anyway. She gave herself. That girl gave her precious sight to make me happy. She gave her sight to make me complete, Father. And I'm never going to let her down, Father. I'm not going. Then get ready to take another woman, no matter what happens. Then get ready, because I am going to do everything but physically and spiritually possible to stop you from getting married to her. Do I take that to be a threat, Father? Of course, you know it's not a threat. Those are words of the king. And I believe you understand better than anyone else. What is going on here? French wine. Uh, okay. Hold, hold on to it. Right. I'd like you to taste it and tell me what you uh, Oh, okay. <laughs> mm. It's soft, eh? It's, it's nice. <laughs> I like it. Like Can it? I drop? No, 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 it's okay. I got, I got this. Thank you. What is the name of that wine? I think it's a French name. I can't quite pronounce it. <laughs> it's, a French name. it's nice. I like it. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but it's it's good to have you here as always. Uh, and you're dressed in thank pink you. today. Really? Yes. Is that the color? That's the color. <laughs> <laughs> My mom chose it for me. You like it? I love it. I'm happy you, you love it. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> I always love to be around you and you know. Thank you for bringing me here. Thank you don't know the level of calm that your presence brings here. You don't know. You have no idea. Thank you, my love. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. But I want to assure you that things will be fine soon, okay? Just keep faith. As long as I have you by my side, I am okay. You'll always have me by my side. <laughs> my mom is here. My queen. Good afternoon. Come see. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. And how are you? I'm good. How is your mother? She's fine. Okay. Um, please. I want to steal him just for a minute. Hmm? Steal me. I hope all is well, Mom. All is well. Hmm? Am I permitted? <laughs> no problem, my queen. Okay. <laughs> it's fine, Mom. I'll, I'll be with you. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. Just a moment. Okay. okay. Take your time. Take your time. Yes, mother, what is it? You don't know. Ah. I think she should go now. Yes, you know your father can walk in any time. Please. You also know that what he feels and what he thinks is of no relevance to me. Listen, there's no need for you to agitate your father. Just allow her to go. Don't worry, I will talk to your father. I'll speak to him. He will, he will come out of this his selfish state. You know what I want? All I want is your happiness. Whatever that makes you happy, you know I will support it. Please, do this for me. Okay? You know, Kamsi came here so that we can spend time together. She only just got here. We haven't had enough time together, so no. I'm not going to let her go. Lutana, be Please. Cool. Be cool. Mom, you see that young lady there? Come see, your Chuku. That's the woman that I am in love with. And that is the one that I am going to marry. I don't care how your husband feels about it. Lutana, be cool, Mom. Be cool, Mom. Listen to me now. Do this for your mother. Please. Are we done here? She's looking so beautiful today. Did you notice? <laughs> She's always a beautiful girl. 
Yes. Of course, immediately I am done going through the document. So I'll get back to you. Even as now, I am going through the documents. It's okay. It's okay. That's good of you. Is coming. Greetings, Father. Greetings, son. How are you? Very well, Father. I can see you are busy. Yes, just uh, going through some official documents. Oh. Uh, your mother told me you left the palace early. Oh, yes, I, I did. As a matter of fact, I went to see the youth leaders. You know, you taught me as a, as a leader. I need to listen to the plight of my people. You know, so I'm trying to put what you taught me into practice. That's wonderful. <laughs> I've always been proud of you. Oh, thank you, Father. <laughs> thank you so much. Ah, you know, as a good father you are to me, I have to practice what you taught me. Not like your son, Lutana, who is currently disobeying you. What are you talking about? I'll speak with you, Father. Lotanna is with that blind girl. That good for nothing girl. And of course, I know you're not aware of that. He dare not. He dare not. Apparently, he does. I only need to see how happy he is disobeying you. Then. Of course, you know I'm going to miss you too. Um, but I am um, seeing you again soon, right? Of course, you'll see me. <laughs> you know, I'll always tell them to come get you. I better still, when I go for shooting practice tomorrow, I just have that. See. Yeah. That would be sweet. Oh, my father is. British. <gasps> Dad! What is this for? Why would you do this to her? Why? You are now challenging the king of this and I, I am not challenging you, Father. I'm asking questions. Why are you embarrassing my guest? Young lady, leave my company and never return again. Father, that's a lie. She goes nowhere, Father. Lotanna, stay out of my way. No, she is my guest. This is also my house, Father. Please, no. Sir, me to go, no, 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 no. Please. Young lady. Lotanna, please take me home. Please. Thank you for what you did in the past. Name your price and I will handsomely reward you. Leave my compound. She goes nowhere, Father. No, she would not go. My, my prince, please, come, come down. No, you are not going anywhere. Oh, Daddy, get him! Becky, allow the guards to take me home, please. Please, my help. Take her, take her home. My foot. <laughs> my prince, please. My prince, don't do something to me. Please, I beg you. Father, close. Nowhere. Young lady, leave my compound. Father, if you don't stop this right now, we're going to have a problem, I'm telling you. Lotana! You have pushed me for so long, and you have embarrassed me for so long, Father. Your tenderness stay out of my path. No, you are the one in my path. She goes nowhere, Father. Please, Young lady, yes. leave my compound. Oh, Daddy, girl, go and lock that gate. Lock that gate, Father. They can't. They, they don't. Lock that but gate. But I tell him not to lock that gate, Father. I am going to wreck havoc, Father. 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 I see chaos coming. Please, I'm begging. Tell them to open that case. What's the problem with you? What? Why are you writing your post against our father? Stay out of this. What can I stay out of this? What can I say? Stay out of this. Stay out of this. I will break your head. Why not stay me instead of out of this? Stay out of this. Why not? Stay out of this. Stay out of this. Mama, there is money in this business. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this money. 
Don't you think that this is too much for you, especially your condition? Eh? Your condition? Mama, but if I stop, how are we going to fare? What can I do? If I stop, how do we feed? You are right, my daughter. You are right. Hi. My Aha! Uh, I can see that uh, our businesswoman is, is back. So, uh, let me have my percentage. What nonsense percentage are you talking about? Eh? Let me have my percentage now as the owner of the house, as the landlord of the house. I see. My friend, let me have my percentage. Which house? This house belongs to my husband. Yes! My husband! Which husband? Mama, which husband? Your husband is dead and buried. Okay. I'm his only son. In fact, I am his only child. And this house belongs to me. As the landlord of this house, I decide what happens here or not. So, let me have my percentage, my friend. After all, you're, you're not paying rent. <laughs> Mama? Mama, let me have my, my, my percentage. It's okay, it's okay. Oh. Chai. 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 Mama, don't, please. <laughs> Ah, God. <laughs> what is that? Oh. One five. One, one five. That means the, the whole market you sold today is just 15,000. You don't do well. You, you don't do well. You have to increase your hustle. So that next time you will not give me. Is that food? Your Majesty, the war going on presently in your home is an issue of public concern. Prince Lotana is your son. The heir apparent to the throne of this great kingdom. He has made his choice for a bride. But you refused him from proceeding for his bride. Wow. Oh no. Are you in any way insinuating that the king shows some bride for his heir? The heir apparent to his throne is born out of a careless thought. A hunter. This your question is irrelevant. Oh no, we never said that. We are only concerned that this might lead to internal disaster. Which will not be good for our king and the entire kingdom. I don't like it. If you don't know what to say, keep quiet. Our king has already mandated Prince Afunwa Elutana eh? to marry Princess Zikolor. Are you not aware that their union will benefit this kingdom immensely? Eh? That is what you are known for. Ringo, 
and I did not talk to him. Oh. Did I talk to you? I if I to did I call you? Oh, I did not. Listen to me. I did not summon you people here to cause nuisance in the palace. I just want to let you know that I want to send delegates to King Ahamba's house to start marriage process immediately. Only be able to send that delegation if you find yourself alive. Please, Lotana, please drop. Please drop that thing. Please. Lotana, I order you as your king to lower that gun immediately. Oh, okay, you have ordered me enough. was a dream. What kind of dream could have startled my lord to this extent? I am beginning to get worried. Uh, what worries That's... you? What worries you? For a while now, I've been having nightmares. One of the nightmares is to see that Lotanna strangles me or oh, he stabs me to death. <gasps> May the gods forbid. May the gods forbid, Your Majesty, nothing will happen to you. So so he attacks you again. Yes. Huh. This time he shot me and uh, Adam your son. Huh. Hey. <coughs> 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 Lotanna, Lotanna, that is not possible. Lotanna has beaten more than he can chew. You see, my instinct can never fail me. I knew that boy was up to something dangerous. Yes, he and his mother. I knew they were up to something dangerous. With the way he has been challenging you lately. I knew they didn't mean well. Your Majesty, please, every drastic situation requires a drastic action. You have to do something and very fast. Ozubo, Ozubo. What do I do? Ah, you're asking me. You're asking me. Call an, for an emergency meeting. Call for an emergency meeting. Gather all the elders of this kingdom. Yes. And announce to them that henceforth, Lotanna is no longer your heir apparent. Yes. After all, he had another son. Look at that in Chukunobi. Good boy. Eh? Man, eh? Very good, very loyal, very respectful, always supporting, encouraging, and able and willing to do whatever you say. Eh? Look, the way this Lutana is even going, you just have to one I'm even beginning to doubt that boy's paternity because he's nothing close to you. Yes! He's totally opposite of you. The one that everybody knows is your blood, is Adin Chukunobi. Yes! You're a good man, and Adin Chukunobi is a good boy. Mm. Make Adin Chukunobi your heir apparent immediately. Immediately, no waste of time. Your Majesty, call no one. Call no one. Should I get your phone for you? Hey, you mean you've been having such terrible dreams about the royal family? And they all seem real. I am telling you, the one of last night, I saw him kill the father and the brother. Hey! Nim, I thought I was, I, I thought it was happening live. When I woke up in the morning, I was thanking God. I had to thank God that it was a dream. 
yesterday's night on was very scary. You know, eh, the recurrence of the same dream is what is making it so scary. Like the same dream every time I dream. Uzamaka, I will go to the palace and tell the king. I have to warn the king. Anumikuru, he say, I have to warn the king. You want to go and tell the king that his son wants to kill him? What is your evidence? Where is your evidence? Mba we will walk up to the king and tell him that his son wants to kill him in your own dream. Debrechi, please. Take care of yourself and your unborn child. Be cool. Please. Yeah. Where? <coughs> I'm going out. Not you know. You know, see, so now I'm going out. Please stop, stop wasting my time. And what, what, what do you do? What don't you understand? What do you mean? What, what, what do you mean? Are you not going to the market today? Or oh, I think I don't. I, I didn't see those plantains you you, you packed there. My friend, let me have the money for the plantains and ask him, what, what, what do you mean? Let me have it now. It's not complete now. You know, you should know now. You should know. Things have gone up. It's no longer 5,000. It's 5,500. May not say so now. I don't have time, please. It's 5,500. I'm just being curious. That money you gave him was for what? Eh? Don't tell me! Don't tell me that you're paying for the plantain you caught from the backyard, Dabenechi! You show up here now unannounced, eh? Un becomes the master of the road where he or she has once lost. Seeing how unfruitful my visit was the last time, I did it, Max. And this became the outcome. Are you here now? Let's see. So what's the purpose for this unscheduled visit? I want us to talk. Talk about what exactly? Us. Who is this person you're claiming to be in love with? What can she offer you that I cannot? Is it wealth? Money? Is it connection? You know, I've loved you. And I'm willing to do anything and everything for you. But you never gave me the opportunity. That is because my heart belongs to someone else. Someone who was there. 
and willing to help when no one else was willing to stand by me. Your Majesty, the mug attendants can help us. I do not want a dead donor. My son, the future king of this kingdom, cannot be seen through a dead person. He must see through a living person. I will, though I know the chances are slim. Your Majesty, please do. His present condition is making the marriage decision a very difficult one. Definitely, I will do everything in my power to get him a donor. Meanwhile, the reason I came is to inform you that my friend will be having her wedding in Canada next month. I will leave in two days. And after the wedding, I will process my one year master's degree. After that, I will do my one year internship program in Dubai. Your Majesty, you see, I will be off for a very long time. I see. Oh, please, don't forget to take good care of yourself, okay? That's my top priority. Good. Lieutenant, make sure you take good care of yourself. And make sure you regain your sight before I come back. Your Majesty, I beg you to take my leave. My regards to your father. You abandoned me. You left, you traveled for your friend's wedding. <laughs> oh, I forgot you had a master's degree program to run, right? <laughs> and then your internship. You know, you had a pile of things to do, really. And then you show up here after two years to deceive yourself. <laughs> Lutan, now for those years, I was communicating with your father. I always ask about you and... Oh, what? And what? You lost your tongue? Zikora. You know, I think you should get married to my father. Yeah. Become his third wife. That would do you a lot of good. Because that even your father can make me leave Kansi. That girl gave me everything. She gave what no human being would give. Lutana, I am an angry bee. Are you? That stinks round. Nobody takes that which belongs to me and leave to tell the tale. Oh, I belong to you? <laughs> <laughs> ah! You have got to be the biggest joke that I have seen. Stay away from her for her own good. Because I wouldn't want to be in Baraz at that time. Or what? out of this place. Lotan! Thank you. Ah, I 
Get dragon. I am not in it. 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 I I Hi. Thank you so much, my Ah, thank God, thank God, Mama. Mama, also, eh? See that plantain? That plantain at the backyard. Who plantain? That plantain is a lifesaver. I'm telling you, if it's that one of yesterday that just ripe, the one I took, with, I, I took to the market. That's what I sold to be able to buy rice. Is you good? I'm telling you. Hey! Oh, Anna. Ah, he's a plantain. Hey, he's a plantain. What he's is a plantain. No. Hey! Thank God, God. God. Um, I've also been thinking. Since plantain is very lucrative right now, you know how much plantain is now? Very expensive. Very expensive. Very, very. Imagine if we had a plantation. If we had a plantain plantation. How much you will be making by now? So I'm thinking if if I can talk to Chetachi to give us one of the farmlands, so we can plant plantain on it. At least a plantain plantation, although it takes time to grow, but at least we're sure of the future. That way we have secured our future. Ah, eh? That would be very nice. Eh, no. That would be very very nice. Mama, plantain business is a big business. In, if you know how much they sell plantain in the city, is it Mama, if we do that business, if during harvest period we we'll export, export out of this village. I'm telling you, hey, the only thing is it takes time, but it's it's a business you do in advance for the future. Hey, I'm so happy for you. I said it was the beginning, It's okay. Remember your condition. Don't, don't, don't take it to heart, oh. Don't take it to heart. told me, but I beg of you, please, tamper justice with mercy, please. I believe she did what she did out of naivety. Naivety, you call it? You are kneeling down with somebody who read law. She ought to have masters in psychology. I have just been patient because of you, but I want you to take this thing out of my house before I run out of my patience. I beg of you, please. For the sake of this innocent child. For the sake of this unborn child, please. I beg of you, help her. I, She's dying. Please. I buried her long ago with her certificate. The very day she decided to choose that fool over me. Now, take her and get out of my house. I said get out of my house before I call the police to arrest you. Please, please. I said, get out! Get out! 
I pray you suffer the more. Who says? Son, please, lower your gun, Vikun. This is your father, the king of this kingdom. King of my kingdom! I need you to tell me! Oh, you kept my woman. Where have you kept Kansi? Where have you kept my woman? Oh, you don't have to tell me. <laughs> call your goons, call for her release, else I am going to forget that I am a seed of your loins and put a bullet in your head. Lieutenant! Lieutenant! Have you lost it? Oh yes, I have. And if you don't stay out of this, I swear I am going to shoot you dead. Here. And nothing will happen. Where is Capsi? Lutana. Where is Capsi? So Lutana, it has gotten to the point of pointing a gun at me. Your father, the king of this kingdom. Eh? Are you aware of the consequences? What consequence could be more fatal than what you've done? This is a case of kidnap. You kidnapped a girl. A good girl. An innocent girl who's done nothing but be good to each and every one of us in this household. Yet you have the heart to abduct her. And you talk about consequences. Father, I ask you, what is this about exactly? Hmm? Is this a case of cowardice or what? I thought you were a king. Oh yes, you're supposed to be a king, yet you act like a rat. Lotana, I will allow this to slide. But next time you accuse me of something as little as this, I will forget that you're my son. I will oh, show no. you stop a nothingality. I am going to allow this slide. The next time I show up standing in front of you, asking for answers as to where you have kept the love of my life, and you're not talking, I swear, by the gods of this land, I am going to make hell look like heaven to you compared to what I am going to unleash on you. You're going to give me answers, Father. You are going to give me answers. Call your goons to let Kamsi go before I put you in a box. Ndidi, have you have you seen what you raised as a son? Have you said it's a common criminal? Eh? You're such a disgrace to motherhood. So this is the kind of king this great kingdom is expected in the future. A common criminal. Guard your tongue. I'll throw you the genesis of this problem. And you are the exodus. You shameless woman. You are the exodus. You can't even raise a good son. A criminal, an unrobust. Quiet! You see this, all this your planet. Quiet! 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 Hey, hey. You know they cry here. I tell you they cry here, you know they cry. Please, who are you? Please, what do you want? I don't want you, I don't want you anything from you. Oh God, what did I do this? Who are you? Please tell me who are you? Shut up! They shut up! I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, sir. I, I just wanted to know what I did so I can apologize. Hey. Shh! One more word from you. I will forget one bullet in this your small skull. Just keep quiet and don't disturb my ear here. I'm sorry. 
Can't you see I'm about to drive out? My prince, the king ordered that we don't let you out of this palace. What did you say? We received the instruction yesterday, my, my prince. What instruction? My prince, the king ordered that we don't allow you to leave the, this palace. So you're not going to open the gate? It was an instruction from the king, my prince. Hold on. Idiots, don't open the gate. Your king, who's your king? I open the gate, now! He was instructed not to open the gate. And there is nothing you can do about it. Nekwanaya. Adim Chuku. That is me. So now you have a gun. Of course. I got this gun as soon as a madness started getting out of hand. Time, but it's not about owning a gun. Now it's about having the heart to pull the trigger. Oh. So then not try me. Try me, Lieutenant, as I swear I won't live to see the next minute. Your father is going to pay for this. Your father is going to pay for this nonsense. Lieutenant, try me! <laughs> of course, pointing a gun at the king is tantamount to treason, and he will not escape it. Not at all. Uh, he won't. <laughs> oh, Hans, I cannot wait for the king to call for that emergency meeting where he will denounce 
that useless fool as the idiot. heir. Yes. Uh, and you know what we stand to gain if Adim becomes the heir. <laughs> you can say that again. You see, this is the time Prince Adim need us most, and we must rally around him massively to support him. Uh, that boy is wise. Mm. That boy is very wise. Mm. I heard that he attends the meeting of the youths. Yes. He, he is gradually willing the hearts of the youths. So. That's what happens when you study political science at school. Everything becomes politics. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I have this plan, mm -hmm. this very particular plan. Mm. Mm? We we'll fetch us a lot of money from Prince Adam mm. if properly executed. Ah. Mm. Tell me about it. I go to my and go there, then I can proceed. You mean you are not telling me about it? No, no. Okay. Yeah. Well, there is time. There is time. Yeah. Yeah. There is time. Yeah. 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 Ah. My kid, who did this poor widow of bed? Let it take away the only precious thing that I have. No, ma, please. Take it easy on yourself. <laughs> How can I take it easy? The light of this house has gone dim. My world has crumbled. No. Like I said, take things easy. Be easy on yourself. <laughs> huh? Your daughter will be found. I'm making this promise to you. As the queen of this kingdom, your daughter, Kamsi, will come back to you safe and unscratched. Okay? Please. I will. <laughs> Nagiel is blind and helpless. Who knows what she has been passing through? Who knows if my daughter is still alive? No, ma. Stop being negative. Stop being negative. Trust to Koki Kabiyam. Your daughter will be found. She will come back to you. Just trust to go I don't know what to trust again. Trust to go I don't know who to trust again. I don't know. It's okay. There's no strength life in me again. No strength. No life in me again. No. My only child, the only thing that gives me joy. It will be found. I will not control you accusing me of such rubbish. Lotanna, you have pushed me for so long. Don't make me to forget the fact that you're my first son. I don't care what you forget at this point, father. Find my woman and bring her back to me. I gave you 24 hours to bring her back, but it's clear that you want to see what a stray lion will do. And I am going to show you, father. If I wanted someone to disappear, trust me, you wouldn't know. Till um. I wanted you to know. <laughs> so you better stop embarrassing me if I lose my grip. Grip. I don't care what you choose to lose at this point, Father. I will only give you peace when you do the need for. Come on, Father. 
You can do this. Do it. If I don't know you to be a coward. Oh, you better watch your tongue, boy. Yes. What? You're the one who crossed the line. Don't expect to play around with my personal life and expect me not to react. I'm not your puppet. Lieutenant! Have you lost your mind? Morgan? Oh, yes. I have lost my mind, Adim Chuku. Stay out of this. No, I won't. Because I will not tolerate you speak to my father in such tone. Because of a low life. An insignificant thing. But... The next time you talk about my woman like that, I will be sure to put you on a wheelchair. And okay. I yell Lord Anna, have you lost your mind? I have lost my mind and I will remain that way. Never to return until Kamsi comes back. I, I hope you are not injured. Lieutenant, the urgency in your voice made me cancel the meeting I had with the governor's daughter. Ever since you got here, you've been looking at me like a piece of trash. Why did you do it? Do what exactly? She has chosen to return. Have you seen how cheap desperation has made you out to be? I don't want to believe you called me to your house just to insult me. There are limits to what Zikora can take. And I don't care what you are going to take from me or not. Alright, you are in my palace. I call the shots, not you. I don't care who you are. I don't care who you represent. I don't care who your father is. You have till the end of today to make sure that they let her go. Lieutenant, I thought you invited me here. To keep you company because you're lonely. Can you bring me up to speed? Can you quit the pretense and give me answers? Because pretense will not get you anywhere with me. Call your goons and tell them to let her go. Who are you talking about? I am talking about Kamsi, goddammit! Call your goons and tell them to let her go! <laughs> oh, I see. The chip team is out of the way. And I don't care where she might be. She can rot in hell for all I care. At least I can breathe some fresh air. I'm not going to breathe. You're going to call them. Call them. Call them. Are you going to call your phones or not? No, I go. What is it? Eh? Please calm down. Calm down what? Calm down you say. Where is that boneheaded son of yours? He, Where is he? He locked himself up refusing to open the door. Then I will break that door and he must come out. I will break that door. What got you this angry my king? You will want to know what got me angry. He had the infantry to order the guards to flog princess Zikora. Just because he suspected her to be responsible for the mission of that useless, weak, flat, blind girl. How the him? What? He, he did that? Woman, oh don't pretend. Anyway, his fate in this kingdom has been decided. Yes! His fate in this kingdom has been decided. Period. My lord, please, I am sorry for what my son did. But I, I, I'm going to talk to him. We're going to, everything will be sorted out. Listen to me. There is no need for that because it's too late. It's mean? too late. How do you mean my king? Yes. Woman, Senator Ahamba just called to call off that marriage between Lotanna and Princess Zikora. 
I said, that is not enough. My long time ambition of becoming the king of kings of these states has cross landed. All thanks to your son. Woman, leave my presence. Am, let me think. I am sorry for all the things. Leave my I'm presence. Not... Let me think. Please, please don't. I said out. Nonsense. Like mother, like son. <sighs> this is serious. How do I cope like this? Eh? By the time I pay 2,000 naira for mama's drug, 3,000 naira for feeding, I am left with nothing. I have not even bought my own drugs. Oh God, this is, this is... ban you from doing anything in this palace whatever you wish to and wherever you wish to go you're free but know it that peace peace will elude you as long as I am alive you are going to have a taste of what it means for a man as powerful as I am to lose his ambition Get out of my sight. Blind lover girl. I gave you all the time in the world. But no, you choose to be dumb. Are you ready to leave my man or not? Listen, I don't have all the luxurious time. Is that the answer? Sky! Finish up this idiot for me! Don't blend them. Don't at all. You won't die. I will shoot you gone. And who are you, pregnant lady? How did you get in here? And how did you bypass my men outside? Take this thing out of here! But I move it. Move outside! I said move! No! 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 Sky! Sky! Where are you running to? Sky! And you! What are you doing here?
Thank you. Thank you. Abiyama will never forsake those that trust in him. Mom, this miraculous deliverance of yours has clearly shown me that. You're very correct, Mama. I wish I knew the person oh, I, I saw her. I would have I would have thanked her properly. But I didn't see her. And I can't see. And the person didn't mention her name. Oh, she didn't mention her name. I didn't even know when she left me. Who is this person that kidnapped you? <laughs> Mama, I don't know. <laughs> but she said her reason for kidnapping me <laughs> is that she's in love with Prince Lotana and she wants me out of the way. My child. Yes, Mama. I think you need to lie low for now. Before things get out of hand. Mama, what are you saying? That I, 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 should, I, should, I should leave my, my priest Lotana. Is that what you're saying? My, my priest Lotana, I should leave him. I think you should avoid him for now. Chuku Kikabem has given you the second chance to leave. Mama, you know how much I love him. You know how much I love him. So what you're saying is not possible. And that is more reason you should leave to fight for another day. I disagree with you, Mama. My child. Make sure you don't stare a hole in my face. How did you know I was staring at you? <laughs> <laughs> We've been together before my blindness, remember? We have been together for almost forever, baby. So and what? we have been through a lot of tribulations. And the gods of our land have always made a way for us to come out of those tribulations. That's right. That's Do you right. understand? Yes. <laughs> And that is why I have decided that I'm not going to live without you. Yeah? <laughs> you have done for me what no one can do for anyone. Thank you. And that is what I call genuine love. That's right. People hail me and call me a total man, but I know that I am incomplete if you're not my wife. And that is why today, in my father's house, I have decided to ask you to please be my wife and spend the rest of your life with me. What about your father? He's taken care of. Okay, so you and I. Not so fast, young man. You think you can be happy after giving me pains? I promise. Same share of pain you will get. Now feel the pain from your own bullets. events of yesterday I know you just look at me and want to kill me 
But unfortunately, for you, you work at Kabiyama. Stronger than you. And as for Kamsi, oh, I'm going to go look for her. I am going in search of the love of my life, and I promise you by Ogugu that I will find her. When I find her, I'm going to get married to her. There's <laughs> nothing you and your guns can do about it. So I tell them to do better this time and come with better weapons. There's nothing <laughs> you all can do to me. Uh, well, you've not uh, started feeling pain. This is simply the beginning. Well, I wish you good luck in finding your lover. Mm. Go ahead and marry her. But we're watching to see the outcome. Go ahead and marry her. <laughs> Mama, the dream was so real. I regained my sight in the hands of... Prince Lutana. It was nice to see his face. But that's a dream. I know. Do not put so much hope on it. But if that is the will of God, then it is fine. I miss him so much, Mama. I, I, I can't wait to see him. I understand, my daughter. But you need to let him be for now. Until everything can down. Since uh, King Ahamba cut off the marriage between Prince and Princess Zikora, I think, I think things have taken a different shape in the palace. Mm. Yes. <gasps> to see you. Same here. <laughs> you know, I was on my way here yesterday to see Mama and I was attacked. But for some miraculous reason, I I, I survived it. I still cannot explain that, how that happened, but I, I'm here. The same miracle that happened to me, <laughs> it shows that we have a big God. God is alive. Yes. I think that now that you're back, it will be a good time for us to begin to plan our marriage. We'll have to get married. What about your father? I don't care. What about me? What about us? What about the things that we want? Huh? It's you that I want and that's all that matters. My love, are you sure it's safe? It is safe. Hello, Chris. Yes, it has to be today. I know I promised to join, but I can't anymore. I have a lot I'm doing here. Please, do this for me, for my mother and my father. That will make it a lot easier for me. Remember, make it perfect. Yes. 
no mistakes. Okay? No disappointment. Thank you. I trust your surprises. All right. Bye. Where is your daughter? My daughter? What have, what have she done? What have she done? I asked the girl. Where is your daughter? She went out with the prince. Please, what did she do? Did she offend you? Boss, she's not at home. It's only her mother. What is the 411? Okay, boss. What is it? You're not talking. What? What is it? What? Where is Mama? Mama? What is it? What is, what is the problem? Mama? 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 Where is Mama? Mama did come out to work on us. Where, where is Mama? What is it? What did you say? What did you say? Who is that? Ah! Where? 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 Where is it? Where is she? Where did you see her? Take me to her. Where is she? Obi, where? Take me to Mama. Where, where is Mama? Oh, my God, Mama, where is Mama? Where, 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 Mama?
kwenu 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 today is a happy day and on behalf of the Okonta family, I welcome all of you. Thank you. You're welcome. Too. Yes. We, the family of Okonta, thank Chuku Okike for a day like this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, at this point, um, I will hand over the drink to our daughter, uh, Kamsi, so that uh, she will take the drink and present it to her husband to be. <laughs> yes. Yeah, let me ah, hand over the drink to her. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, come see. Yes, I'm Yes, 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 yes. Take the drink and uh, present it to your husband to be. Yes. 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 And that's the lucky man. <laughs> that's the lucky man. Don't know, I don't know. Sorry, take it. It's okay, it's okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. What is all this now? What is all this? Mama, I don't know. Sorry. Amechi? Amechi? Mama, Mama. What happened to him? Mama, I don't know. I just saw him like this on the road. I just I decided to bring him home. It's okay, sorry. Chetachi? Chetachi, what is wrong with you? What happened to you? This is exactly how he has been doing. When I saw him, that's why I bring him home. Sorry. Hey. Sorry. What am I going to do now? Mama, 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 don't cry. Don't. Why, 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 don't cry. The village is not around. What am I going to do in this condition? Look at me now. Mama, let's just watch him. Let's see what will happen next. Please, don't. It's not time to cry now. Don't worry. Watch, watch this man like this, running like this. You want him to grow and die? Eh? Abba, mama, he will not die. Don't worry. I'll take care of him. Let me just take him inside. Uh, don't worry, okay. don't worry. It's okay. okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, yeah. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mama, don't worry. Try now. Try. Mama, don't worry. I'll, I will take care of you. It's okay. Hey, 
Mama, don't cry now. I will take care of him. It's okay. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, please. Eh? Thank you yes. very much. Uh, don't just worry. Just lying down. They lying down on the yes, yes. Uh, on okay. the chair inside. Yes, ma'am. Yes, mama. Mm. It's okay. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. 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 Hey! Why is it? Why you? Why you? Sorry, sorry. Take out of this place! Take out of this place! No, 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 no! no. Take out! Take out! Take out! Take out! Have you seen what my son brought in here? Have you seen that? Why his mates are there representing their fathers Igwe, in the Igwe. council of Igwe's? Please, your majesty, please, please, calm down, calm down. Uh, you just came in from a very serious summit. Uh, I expect you to rest at least for a day before you start calling for, uh, for cabinet with... Oh no, who can't you see that things are going wrong already? Uh, uh, but with your two eyes, you watch what displayed in this, uh, in this palace. Your majesty, please, I will just plead you calm down. Can you? But I'm better all of you. I am going to disappoint him this time around. Because I am going to do the right thing this minute. Your Majesty, please take it easy. It is obvious you are tired and worn out. Exactly. Please, I wouldn't want you to make a rash and hasty decision in this stage. Please. Mbadefo, what are you saying? What are you trying to say? That our king is no longer capable of taking a decision. How dare you ask me that was stupid? He question. never said anything like that. He Mama. never said anything like that. Is that what he meant? But that's what he said. How do you know why both of you will not allow but the king to be what he said? Saying. Are you going to be a close man? Why are you just causing commotion? You are just causing trouble here. Why are you causing trouble here? I don't understand. Enough. You will not keep quiet. Enough. I said enough. Keep quiet. He waits something. Before I will serve your head to the gods. Shut up. Let me remind you that you are my palace. I still have the sole right to have you come down here. I am just talking about a mad woman my son brought in to mess up the palace. You are here ranting. Let me tell you now. As the king of this kingdom. The custodian of our tradition and customs. I hereby denounce Prince Lutana as the heir to the throne of my ancestors. What? And I enthrone Prince Adem as the new heir. I so declared. But meanwhile, I will fix a day for the cleansing of the new heir. You can now go to your houses. Your Majesty. This is real love. No one can tear us apart. Bobby Moon, Jerry Moon, the Bobuni. No, I am coming for you. It doesn't matter what is going on right now. It doesn't matter what. Greetings, my prince. Uh, greetings. Uh, please, I need your help with something. I'm wondering if you've seen this young lady. Uh, no, my prince, I haven't. She's not mentally stable, and it's important that we find her and take her you know, back to the palace. I'm sorry, my prince, I haven't. What hurts you is within the walls of the palace. Things have already gone wrong. But you need to control your temper to save yourself 
and prevent things from getting worse. Self-control is a virtue you need to imbibe right now. If truly this message is coming from a sincere and pure place, I would say that it's a bit too late. For if I do not find my bride and take her back to the palace, things can only get worse. Remember, one does not venture into a battle when his chi is against it. Do not give your enemies striking opportunities. I leave you in peace, son of Mbadike. My prince, please do not take her away from him. You have to drink. No, you have to drink. Drink now so you can get better. Try, try, just try. Cheta, eh? mm -hmm. open your mouth. Oh. Cheta, stop now. Eh? Stop. You know this is not water. Eh? I know. It's because it's medicine. You need to take it to get better. If you don't drink it, you will not be better. Do you want to get better? Eh? Keep drinking. Keep drinking. You have to finish it. Cheta, open your mouth. You have to finish it. Oh, Cheta, stop now. Eh? Don't pour it out. I'll, I'll get another one and we'll start again. It's not supposed to be sweet now. It's medicine. Eh? It's medicine. It has to be bitter for me to walk. If you don't open your mouth, I'll give it to you like a baby. Do you want me? You want me to force you? Force it in? Can I rest? No, you can't rest when you're done drinking. You rest. Cheta, open your mouth now. Open, open. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Keep drinking. Open it. Open it. Open. Cheta, this thing is pouring away now. Stop. Are you a baby? Do you want to die? Cheta, do you want to die? You want to leave me and my baby like this? You want to you want to abandon me and my baby? Is that your plan? Is it your plan? It's bitter. Can't you endure bitterness and get well? I don't like what you're doing. Yeah, you now open your mouth. Cheta, I'm resting. I'm rest. Do you want to die? No. Do you want to die? No. Then drink so you'll be better. I'm rest. I'm rest. This is your morning dose now. You're still going to drink the afternoon. Do you want me to keep all of them for you at most? I know. I didn't tell you it's sweet. But try me. After eating now, I'll prepare good food. Yes, she is always on time. <laughs> That's my job, my king. Oh, thank you for the scrumptious dinner. I can't forget it in a hurry. Hmm? Meanwhile, I'm still battling with my decision as regards to breakfast of what I'll take, the home late, work out, or whatever. But just Call me in the morning before anything, okay? I'm honored, my king. First thing in the morning, I shall be here. I can even stand guard if you think I will forget. That's all right. Um, please take care of yourself and sweet dreams, okay? Thank you, my king. All right. And sleep well. Thank you. Please do not forget to say your prayers. Yes, she comes again. Making me to feel like a baby. I'm not a child. I will. <laughs> um, least I forget. I hope we took your 
night tea prescription from the doctor? Yes, of course, you know, I can skip it. Thank you so much for keeping level eye. You're welcome, my king. Thank you. Enjoy your sleep. Thank Good you. Good night. Good night. Such a nice girl. Oh. Don't you, can't you say that you will soon give birth? Eh? Do you think that going to people's farm at this stage of your pregnancy is convenient for you? Even for the baby? No, it's okay, I'm alright. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. I can manage. Fine. Let me run along before the sun comes out. I, oh, Let me see what I can do. Please just be careful. Oh, when, when, when you get there, be careful. Oh, why your 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 why I am sorry. Please. Find a place in your heart to forgive me. I am, I am sorry for all the treatment. I am, I am sorry for all the pains I caused you. Please. Ever since you, you came into this house, I have shown you nothing but pain. I brought you so much tears. I am sorry. I am sorry. I, I I know I'm not deserving of your love. I'm not deserving of your forgiveness. But please, please, I beg you. I, find a place in your heart to forgive me. Please. I I I lack words to to even ask for your forgiveness. I I am so ashamed of every, everything I did to you. From the depth of my heart. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I'm willing to make amends. I, I promise to love and care for you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. If there is no sin, there will be no forgiveness. Every wrong you've ever done to me, I have always forgiven you. Each time and every time you have wronged me, I have always forgiven you. And do you know why? What? Because I love you. I love you. And I still love you. I'm sorry. I, I am sorry for all the pains I caused you. I, I know I know I've brought you nothing but shame. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm I'm so happy. I'm so happy for this reunion. I'm so happy. This this simply tells me that I'm going to live longer. I'm still going to live longer. I'm so happy. So happy. Come, 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 come. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. I'm so happy. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the change. Thank you. You've done me well. You've done me well. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you for this. I thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
Land are you going to tell her? Okay. Um, yeah, you know what? Just wait for me. Let me, let me go with you. Let my son go and show his Odogu. I, 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 I will show you that is your Odogu. My, my skill. Yes. No, I, I, I have been wife. He's strong, go. He's strong. Forget all this thing that he has been doing. Hey, uh -huh. go and help your wife. That's good. <laughs> When gen, 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 gen. When you see when you get there, you be, be, be behaving like a baby. You understand that you ask. You, you just, just sit down. Uh, hey, you hey I like you what you want, eh? Yeah. Uh, I remember to be rubbing the stomach. Hey, man. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming. All right, my right, dear. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm coming. Oh, 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 Good morning, my king. Your chef is here to take your breakfast order. Good morning, my king. I said your chef is here to take your breakfast order. Should I come back later, my king? My king, I used to sleep in. Should I come back later to take your order? My king. My king. Warrior has left the battlefield without notice. I... Did he at any time complain of anything health wise? Not at all. You know, my husband, he has always been very strong and healthy. He didn't complain about anything. Oh, Renna, did he complain about anything to you? Oh. Where is Lutana? He left early this morning to search for Kamsi before we heard the news of His Majesty's demise. Oh, oh, oh. So after killing my father, he went to go and bring that blind pin. <laughs> I will deal with him. Now what you look? Ask him now, boy, tell him. Oh, no, ma. Why would your son make such a dangerous allegation? Oh, no, 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 Uche. Don't blame my son. It is because Lotana threatened his majesty yesterday. Threatened him so much. In fact, he, he ended it by saying, uh, I pray you live to tell this tale. But those were the words of an angry man. Nothing more. And those angry man's word that was directed to the king is why he is dead. How do you explain it? Elders, 
you all know that my son, Lieutenant, is a very stubborn boy. But he's never a killer. But he just killed! He just killed my husband! You accused my son of, of, of a killer! Your son is a murderer! Eh? Why do you accuse my son? You, what is wrong son. with you? Why do you look for Remember every slightest You are your son! son. Like you I'm not son talking to you! What is your problem? You what are a killer! And let me want? tell you, he what must face the consequences. He, he must face the consequences, so your son will not go scot free. Blood sucking demons, that's what you are. Blood sucking demons! My Lieutenant. So here you are, drinking to your victory. Hmm? Madam, please. Not now. Allow me some moment of peace, please. Peace, you said? There will never be a moment of peace for you, Lutana. And as long as I live in this palace, you will never have a moment of peace. This boy, what do you want? You ask me what I want. Very well then. Very simple question. And I'll give you a very simple answer. Lord, then I want you to face the consequence of killing my father. And I'll go extra mile for this singular case. How can you say a thing like that to me? How can you accuse me of killing our father? I don't. Why would you level such heavy allegation against me? Oh, come on, stop the pretense. Everybody is aware that you never liked my father. Everyone knows. Huh? Just yesterday you threatened to deal with him. And now, he's dead. Lieutenant, welcome to my world because I will continue where my father stopped. Uh, welcome, stop personalizing this thing, alright? He was also my father. And you treated him with such contempt. I never hated our father. All right, we were men. We were naturally, we were going to butt heads. Uh, we disagreed on a lot of matters. That does not mean that I hate my father. Okay, the things that I said to him, I said out of anger. I never meant that. Lutanga, I wanted to face the wrath of that anger. Hey God, God, please, please. Hey. My daughter, it's okay. My daughter, please. Breathe, just breathe in, be breathing in and out. Breathe in, 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 out. Uh -huh. So that you have more energy. It's okay. Gradually, gradually. Lean, lean on him, lean on him. Oh, wait, I know the back. She's the back. She's the back. Jidiaka, Jidiaka. Eh. Don't see what? Baba, don't. Hey. Oh God, 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 God. Hey. 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 Hey.
Oh, oh yeah, let's let's let the weight of our body be on your body. Let me sit down. Ah, hey, you here. No, no, no. Can't see, can't get one. Can't see, can't get one. Hey, don't, 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 Keke! What are you doing? Don't the keke fast! It's okay, it's okay! Drop my back! You're almost there, you're almost there! My fellow elders, as the custom demands, one week after the demise of the king, the heir is cleansed to become the acting king until the king's remain is put to rest. So now the question is this. Between Prince Lutana and uh, Prince Adim, who is the rightful heir? Oh no. See, the way you speak sometimes leaves me puzzling. If you are indeed an elder or an overgrown baby. Ahanta. What has come over you? Chetani oh, Namakeba. Meaning what? How dare you insult Ono of this kingdom? Simply because he asked a crucial question. Eh? Mbanefo. Hmm. What type of useless crucial question is that? I wonder. Eh? We were all here when our Igwe, late Igwe, denounced Prince Afonwa Ilotana as the heir and pronounced him to Adam, Prince Adam here. Eh? Why are we battling over this? You see? Oh no, we we'll do the info. You see? It is obvious you people are not in your right senses. You were there. When the late king made the pronouncement out of anger. So what are we saying? Out of anger or out of joy. The fact remains that we, the elders here, are natural, bore witness to that. Mm. Mm. So let we, the elders, always remember our tradition before we make utterances. Oh. Remember, one, the king did not stamp his utterances with the offer of this kingdom. Did he? No. Secondly, the king is not here to bait the new heir at the river of Ugugu. So, what do we do about that? Oh no, mm, so bonto. Both of us know that the same tradition made it clear that you can do the same in the absence of the king. So why are you playing around around? I wonder. On the occasion that the unknown supported the whole thing. But no. I never supported the decision. Never. And you and I know that if I enter the river of Ogugu to bait Adim without supporting Adim, Ogugu is going to strike me dead. And I don't want to die now. Oh no. Oh no, you lied. My father has already pronounced me the heir to the throne. And so shall it be. And who are you to speak? Okay. When you have not been ordained by your people. Huh? You are too ambitious. Stop it. Great examples of my land. <laughs> Sorry I showed up late. I cannot help but say that I overheard all that has been going on here. But let me state emphatically that I am the ordained heir to the throne. As you all know, it's only fitting that I am crowned king. While we wait for the remains of my father to be laid to rest. You call him father? Huh? You can imagine the gods. You call him father after he's dead. Then what can avoid me? Abode in the leggy cock, in the lepiagi walk him. In the lepiagi. Boy, and I am a whirlwind that will sweep you into oblivion when you least suspect. So you want to kill me the same way you killed my father? Ah! <laughs> 
So in your little fantasy, you think I am as old and weak like my father. Listen up, Luther, now. As long as nothing can change this part of a leopard, nothing can stop me. And nothing can change my position at the heir to the throne of my father. Nothing. Get that into your notice call. Adam, you know that when the meeting of men is called, eunuchs stay back home. Adam, stay away from me. Stay away from me. Okay, but I want to let you know what I'm going to do. You could be a bully. A bully. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Stay away from me. For what you seek is bigger than you. The next time you stand in my way, <laughs> I assure you that what you're going to witness will be too big for your feeble mouth to spill. I said, "Na wanza no ni lone tebu. No wese na koli yegu ni mafia. I am not scared of the words that I hear every day." At the snap of my finger, okay, you will disappear from this kingdom. I said so. Well then, we shall see. Let's watch and see. We shall see. And I want. <laughs> she's sleeping, right? <laughs> she's she's sleeping on Mama's lap. I told you. I told you. That girl, as small as she is, she already recognizes her grandmother. Once the woman carries her like this, she sleeps straight up. <laughs> Your kind is very rare. <laughs> no more, it is God. It is not by my power, not by my strength, but by the grace of God. <laughs> did you hear that voice? Which voice? I didn't hear any voice. A male voice. I did not hear any voice. Yeah. Taberechi. The time is now. Prepare for the journey ahead to Tokyo. Taberechi, who were you talking to? Oh. I I I I don't know. But I I I I heard a voice. It was it was coming from this direction, like a light was coming from there. I didn't hear anything, David. Are you okay? David, are you okay? I'm alright. Honestly, I don't know why he behaved like that. But I will speak to him. Sure, don't worry. I promise to settle everything. Okay? It's alright, alright. Don't worry, I'll do my best. Just trust me, I will handle You this wicked woman! You are here! You are here pretending! Please I'll call you. Are you are here pretending! I'll call you back. Pretending as if all is well. Meanwhile, you're busy. Killing people, you and your wicked son are just the only thing you could know how to do is to kill. Is to kill! The other day, your son threatened my husband, the king. And the next day, you could not see the light of the day. Now, you people have, have attacked my son. You have attacked my son. If you know whatever you have done, whatever you and your stupid son has done to my son, you better go and undo it now. You better go and undo it now, Judy. Ulam, are you mad? You are the one that is mad. You are the mad woman. Oloma, it's you, it's you that knows how to do evil, it's you that will know what you did to your son. How dare you accuse me of your son's predicament? You see? What is wrong with you? You see, 
I was even expecting you to ask me what is wrong with my son. Which means you already know what you have done. Really? You know what you have done in Didi? Well, I give you between now and end of today to undo whatever you have done to my son. If not, this whole palace will not contain both of us. Oh, Loma, it's you that knows how to do evil that will know what happened to your son. Yes, wicked woman. It's you that will know what happened to your son. Wicked woman. You're here looking for who to accuse over your son's nonsense. Listen to me. In fact, I don't even know how you got into this fight. How will you know? I don't know what our husband saw in you and brought a woman like you into this fight. It's because you are useless. That's why because they want me to replace, to replace listen, you. Listen, you have no quality. Between you have no end quality of, of a queen. Between you have no quality of a queen today. at all. Hey, Ndidi. 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 If my son does not get well at the end of today, you will not like yourself, oh. You will not like yourself. Oh, Lama, you've started uh, ripping your, your, all your evil. you started ripping all your evil. Don't I don't have I word for you. you. I don't have word for you. Ah. What nonsense. I don't know how our husband brought this woman into this palace. Eh? Hmm. The thing which is eating the bitter leaf is within the bitter leaf. Those were the exact words of the seer. Is it not now very clear that Lotanna is the cause of all these things? Do you call yourself a hunter or a huku? How are you sure? Am I the seer? I said the seer said. Not me. Mbanefu, if it's not him, who else? I wonder. Eh? Look, I mean, someone who threatened his father and brother with a Jew. And he betrayed them. Oh no, we cannot fold our hands and continue to see things go wrong in this kingdom. No. At all. And oh no, the way you and the GM Banefu are going about these things and beginning to sense sentiment in this. And if you fail to do something, oh no, if you fail to act, we are going to take this matter to the governor. A hunter and a gada. Mm -hmm. How do you people raise him? What has come over you? Best of the same feathers that flock together. Sure. That's what you are. Uh -huh. It has not gotten to that. Let me tell you. We all know that Lotana and his father were long ahead. But that doesn't mean that he inflicted anything on them. After all, these are mere rumors. No one caught him red-handed. You should know that. Ichi Mbanefo, you don't need to get close enough to the he goat to find out that it smells. <laughs> we need to do something now. That's what I'm saying. Oh no, you've been keeping quiet. This is your call. What is your verdict? What is your verdict? Why are you attacking him like that? Well, elders, yes. prepare. Tomorrow we will take Prince Lutana to the river of Ogugu for oath taking. Hmm? Now you are talking. Why? Now hmm? you are talking. This is what you would have done since. Is it okay now? Ah, very, Not very okay. okay. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, but you know, you elders have to excuse me. I'll be going to Umwe Kenta first thing tomorrow morning. <laughs> my in-law, my father-in-law fell from pantry. So it will be disastrous if I did not see the man before his demise. Mm. Oh, Hunter, don't worry yourself. You I'll be here alive and the right. Keep quiet, I'll be here. You don't want to go. You, you, you elders are there. Say you don't want to go. Great servant of Ugu, Prince Lutana is ready to take the oath. Please, can you take us to the river of Ugugu? Hmm. Not always. Men always jump in into conclusion. You make judgments without consulting your chief. Have you forgotten that you have a creator? How dare you make judgments without 
consulting the great Ogu himself. I am not here to take Prince Lotanna to any river. My master, the greatest of the mortal realm, Ogu himself, sent me here for another mission, which I have come here to do. There's been a puzzle going on in this royal household and in the kingdom at large. Now my master sent me to unravel that puzzle. Elders of our new, by default, your mission is to uphold peace. You are nominated to be great custodians of the customs and traditions of this kingdom. You are to uphold peace, maintain balance and timing. But what have you done? You allowed selfishness, ego, and pride to take over you. You have so been engulfed by evil that you have forgotten that which Ogugu gave to you as an assignment. You have gradually lost touch of your sanctity, and that is unpleasant before my master. You are supposed to lead the kings of this kingdom to all righteousness, but you have failed woefully in your duty as elders. The fire that you set here is almost reaching the land of the immortals, and my master frowns at that. Therefore, he sent me to quench that fire before it reaches the immortal realm. Now, the puzzle which I have come to unravel is as a result of the king's past fact, the hurt he did in the past. That is what I have been sent here to do. Stop! Okay. I shall forgive your ignorance. I shall forgive your stupidity because of the great ordeal you have passed through in the past and is still passing through. Now, as the great servant of Ogugu himself, I command you to speak. Tell your story, O mortal. I have told you several occasions, stop calling my life. Stop disturbing me. What is your problem? I don't want to sell the land, this is by force. I don't want to sell it. Stop calling my life. You are very stupid. I don't want to sell it again. This is not by force. Okay, if that land is land I'll keep for my daughter. I don't want to sell it again. I told you, don't, don't call this line again. Okay. Oh, the man of the Nadia. I'll tell you the person can go You go not for a crack or walk around. What's not possible? Ah! No point in my phone, one guy. Stop him. Papa, 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 what is it again? Is it not the, the, the present body? Every time this man is stopping me about the land. What you, I, don't, I don't know what is this man's problem. I told this man I don't want to say this and this man is stopping me. Eh? Then stop disturbing yourself. Eh? You don't want to say the land, then leave it. The man will not take it by force. You can never try it. 
Yeah, please. Can you help me with the Biko? Yeah, Biko. 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 Stop the story in your face. Come on, Rina. Are you sure of what you're telling me? Are you really sure of what you're saying? Because this is not a, a joking matter. Are you sure? I'm very, very sure. I saw them killed my parents. On my way coming back from school. I saw them and I don't know what to do. I decided to hide. So how then do you know that it was the prince that sent them to kill your father? How sure are you? I overheard them calling the prince that the mission had been accomplished. If that's the case, you have to be very careful though. You don't have to allow anybody else to hear this. Because if anybody else hears this and this matter gets to the king or gets to the prince, they will come and kill you in this house. You're still small, you're still tender. You just come and be moved like pigeon. I don't know what I will do. Only you cannot stay in this house. For now. Only you cannot stay here. I will advise you now to run to your maternal home or go to your grandmother and stay. Because if you continue staying in this house, they might come and kill you. You're still small. I don't know what else to do. So I said I should let go. Eh, uh, I didn't say you should let go. You know what I'm saying? For now, you don't have the power, the capacity, to, the strength to carry this battle. You're still small. That's my own point. Just look for a way and hide now. For now, maybe later, later on, you can come back and fight for yourself or look for one thing, what else to do. I don't know. Just look for somewhere and hide your head first. Because, see you now. Can you battle the prince or the king? They have money. They are so influential. What else do you want that they don't have? Do you, what do you get? See where you're staying. Don't do this, oh. Please. I'm begging you. It's still important to me. Pico. Sorry, 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 sorry. You're still important to me now. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Sorry now. I know it's painful, but sorry. Sorry. I tried to tell people that he was the one that killed them, but no one believed a little girl. So I went to live with my grandmother. And I vowed! To make sure he paid for everything! He did. To work here as a maid in order to be close to the man who butchered, butchered my parents. I needed to be the chief maid. That was why I killed the formal chief maid. <laughs> I got close to the king. He saw me like the daughter he never had, which made his curling very simple. <laughs> that night. Put some sleeping pills in his nice tea. And I suffocated him with a pillow. (laughs) 
I wanted to kill Kamsi. They justify the royal crisis. Says Jolet could not do it. When the man I sent could get there. Kamsi's mother was already dead. <laughs> when I inquired, I found out it was Prince. Madness. Is my making. Servant of Ogugu is not here to pronounce death sentence. I have done that which my master sent me to do. And Ogugu is blessed with good traditions and custom. When the wise and just king is crowned, he shall decide your fate. For the kings of Ogugu are blessed with wisdom and understanding. Whatever his judgment is, that is what your fate shall become. People of Aneogugu, I leave you to Ogugu's worthy vessel. Servant, servant of the great Ogugu, please, what is my son's fate in all of this? Your son has committed lots of sacrilege. I am sorry to tell you this. He is dead. No! 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 Get ready. For Ogugu himself is about sending a new reign. You are going to crown a new king. And in the first time in history, it is going to be on a morning that is bettered by the full moon of Ogugu. This is your mission.
Igbo kwenu. Yeah. Igbo kwenu. Yeah. Kwenu. Yeah. <laughs> hey. It is said that a true warrior will not abandon the battlefield due to previous defeat. Yes. 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 <laughs> ah, we are gathered here once again. Yes. For the marriage ceremony of our daughter, Kamsi. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, having fulfilled all marital rights, I will be handing over the drink to her so that uh, she will show us her husband to be. Yes. Our daughter, yeah, here's the drink. Uh, take the drink, eh, and go and show us your husband to be. My prince, <laughs> on behalf of members of my family, the Okonta family, I welcome you as our new in-law. <laughs> you are welcome, my prince. Yes. <laughs> ah, my prince, today is a happy day. Yes. Uh, I pray for this marriage. I pray that Chukwokiki bless this marriage. Yes. Your marriage shall be fruitful. Yes. You shall live long. Yes. Bueno, yeah. bueno, yeah. bueno, bueno. Yeah. Today, indeed, the gods of Anubu have smiled on us. Today is a day of rejoicing. Yes. It's a joyful day. Sure. We are crowning a new king today that will lead each and every one of us to prosperity. <laughs> so, I, Mbakwe, in my capacity as the Ono of this great kingdom, I'm going to crown you, Lotana, the first of your name, as the king of Anyogugu kingdom. <laughs> uh, I bless you with the blessings of our ancestors. Yeah. Your reign will be peaceful. Your reign will be filled with joy. Yeah. We will have enough to eat and drink. Yeah. There shall be no poverty. Yeah. Uh, 
the heir apparent to the throne after you. The God has given you already. Say. It shall be well with you. Twenty highway. <laughs> King Lutana. The Verity. Your Majesty. You know that I cannot thank you enough. For what you have done, not just for me, but the entire royal household. And I believe that I owe you a lot. Your Majesty, I did nothing. I was only a vessel used by the great Okoki. <laughs> I like your humility. <laughs> uh, I invited you here because I. I want to reward you. Tabarichi, <laughs> I understand how uncomfortable it is for you. But please, relax. Eh? Tell me, just ask, whatever it is that you want, I'm willing to give to you. Go ahead, ask. Your Majesty, I I need nothing from you. But I have a favor to ask of you. I got pregnant out of wedlock. And my father disowned me since he has refused to accept my apology. Hello. Your Majesty. Yes. Please, if you can talk to my father, I will deeply appreciate it. Your father is Chief Williams, right? Yes, Your Majesty. Hmm. It's fine, I'll speak to him. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. And thank you so much. Get up. Eh? Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> My dear friend, thank you very much, okay? No, thank you. <laughs> so, um, how's your daughter? She's fine. She's playing with her grandmother. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Michael. Thank you so much. I hope you know that you're now a member of the family. <laughs> oh. <laughs> of course Thank you are. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Let me have my granddaughter. Yes. You're welcome. Hmm. Please, but if you can sit down. Hmm? Baby, how are you? Hmm. <laughs> yes. Thank you so much, Father, for accepting our apology. Thank you. Thank you so much, Chief. I, I promise to be a good son-in-law. I mean, I promise to make you part chief. I know. You see, uh, I am proud of you, Dabrachi. The king told me all the things you have done so far. <laughs> you see, I am so sorry for treating you the way I did just for my selfish desires. 
I'm also apologizing for this little baby, for calling her names even when she was yet unborn. Father, it's, it's okay. I am happy everything is fine now. Young man, please, what do you do for a living? Uh, uh, Chief, I, I lost my job some time ago. So I, I do minor jobs right now. My son-in-law doing minor jobs when I can help. <laughs> you see, please come over tomorrow. We have a place to go to. Thank you so much, Thank you so much, It's okay. This time, call me father. <laughs> Please sit down, sit down, sit down. Thank you, father. Thank you. That's good. That's yeah. Maybe. How about you?